Hello guys, welcome. You are watching Technology Welfare. Let's see in this video tutorial how to remove a completely iCloud activation log from any Apple device. See, at this moment, this phone has linked to an Apple ID and asking that enter your Apple ID and password that were used to set up this device. So we don't know what is the password, what is Apple ID. In this situation, how you will execute the procedure to terminate it. Let's see in this video tutorial with the help of iTunes. iTunes as we know that this has been developed by Apple Authority software developer so definitely this is a more reliable and 100% uh, uh, you will be able to terminate iCloud activation log if you watch carefully step by step this video tutorial. But uh, one thing I would like to remind you guys, I will use a for time being three your tools also to execute, uh, to deactivate this device. Deactivate means here just uh, my motive after all to turn off, find my phone off this device so that activation lock will be unlocked. So I will come in a three your tools and we have uh, one option here, see, deactivate this device deactivate i device so i will use this deactivate i device when i will click here it will start to deactivate and uh, at the present time it won't be a functional why it is so because i'm not going to execute on a specified in course of time guys so i will get a exact time on the time i will execute this procedure and Finally, we will be able to deactivate it. At the moment, if I go to deactivate, it's a saying that uh, it's unnecessary. I stop activating it. So just I will go for OK here. I will minimize it and uh, I will come on here. Let me show the once again, guys. See this device when I will exit this data cable from this iPhone device and inserting data cable in iPhone device, it's a saying that this phone has been linked to an Apple ID and password. So actually, I don't have a, the camera so that I will record with the uh, uh, iPhone device also. So just uh, I'm recording at the moment uh, the monitor only one. So watch it carefully, of course, and that is enough to unlock. No problem at all, guys. So at the moment, first of all, I'm going to keep this device, iPhone device is officially in DFU mode. So in DFU mode, different iPhone device has a, a specified key to push into DFU mode. So in the situations, if you don't know, uh, at the moment this is iPhone 6, so key button to keep in DFU mode is just uh, you have to uh, power off your iPhone device and then you have to hold the home button and insert once again data cable into iPhone device and wait till iTunes logo is not reflected on your iPhone screen. If you don't know uh, specified because suppose if you are unlocking uh, iPhone uh, 5s uh, yeah, just um, uh, 10 uh, 8 then the situation if you don't know then simply just you have to come in the once again through your tools and you have to go for in enter recovery mode and just go for enter it so when you will enter here guys it will try to push into DFU mode so let's minimize it firstly here I will minimize it now see I'm on a iTunes just I will go for cut from here and I will click on this restore so now I will go for but see before proceeding you must assure yourself that uh, data of your internet server especially data of your internet and this will be more than 4 GB because it will take uh, time to download then it will start to extract guys I have already downloaded this um, call IPSW so now it's uh, working directly it has uh, started to extract otherwise it will uh, start to here download firstly 
So data should be sufficient approximately 4 GB. If you unlocking the iPhones uh, above iOS 10, then of course, otherwise less than 3 GB data if you have on your internet, you can do it, no problem at all. Now see guys here, one thing more, that uh, data cable, you must use the original of your iPhone device. Now, third one is a very important thing that you have to remind your mind that uh, you have to find exact region of your cell phones. Suppose this phone is from Australia, we need to create a virtual network private of your internet terminal of Australia's. So, I have already created a uh, virtual network private of Australia and now see guys here uh, internet should be connected while you proceeding to all the procedure here so now it has uh, started to extract all the software so let's see if I come in a uh, three or toes what's I will get a message here it's in a recovery mode finally now if I go in a toolbox in a toolbar see actually what I will get here this deactivate i device is in a hidden mode it's not a functional at the present time so when it will be highlighted then we will execute it so let's see i have to wait till the completion so now it's uh, preparing now so the whole procedure can be more than especially uh, I'm in 20 minutes so you have to watch carefully step by step because this is more reliable guys with the help of the iTunes so now phone has started to flash it all so now see it's very fine for your storation of this IPSW so I have to wait the tilts in the completion guys. So keep watching till the complete guys. Otherwise uh, see if you watch it carefully step by step then you will have the much information how to execute because on a specified time we have to execute this uh, options that is given already in a uh, three tools and uh, as we know that three tools also has been developed for Apple device so we will use here these functions uh, that uh, deactivate i device let me minimize it and now it has uh, started to restore all the iPhone software so let's see if you're facing any problem guys uh, uh, for example technical error yeah any problems to understand uh, that how you will execute this yeah wherever you face any problem then of course uh, uh, you can raise the query below the comment box I will reply as soon as possible according to your query guys in course of time so now see it will take a time so I will have to wait till the completion of this so it's a uh, live recorded guys so I will assure you, uh, if you was uh, till the end, of course, uh, this phone will be unlocked with the help of the iTunes and 3 tools. I'm not going to use the any software here. So, let's see. I will have to wait. As we know that when you execute the, all the procedure with the help of the iTunes, it will take a time because it's a genuine and uh, more reliable method to terminate this. Yeah, man, motive, you know, uh, 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 as we know that uh, that to turn off the fine my phone, so that's why and already in the three year tool already given by a software developer to turn off this. Here, uh, yeah, see deactivate i device so i will have to wait till it's not going to highlight it now it has started to verify the software so let's see
it's uh, still very fine and if we check it out there is uh, deactivate i device is not uh, still highlighted so i will have to wait it will be highlighted like a special guys there's features so that we can execute it but i will have to wait till the complete of this whole procedure by iTunes then we will execute uh, three utils but whole procedure you have to execute at the terminal of virtual network private scene there what's the country belong your phones for example this phone has been sold in the Latin America though in that situation you will have to create virtual private network of Latin America so easily you will be able to get a good frequency from the Apple server to unlock this otherwise if you don't get a good frequency of uh, Apple server so in that situation you will have the problem to unlock this device so now say it's a restoring the framework so probably we are on a path so let's see now it's a very fine one thing let you remind it's a not a matter of anxiety guys when your iPhone devices rebooting one time two times it doesn't matter let it reboot so now it's a very fine guys here It's verifying. If I see here three utils, let me check it out. It's highlighted or not? Still, it's not highlighted, guys. So I will have to wait. And one thing also, when your phone will be rebooted, then the situation your iTunes will be exit. So when it will be executed, you are disconnected, guys. In the situation, don't worry. Uh, automatically, it will once again connect with your iTunes. Let it reboot. So at the moment, verifying after verifying the restorations, then. It will start to reboot and then it will start to once again now see guys here now it has started to restore so I will go for ok and now see it has been disconnected now so I will go for just minimize it and I will come on this three your tools uh, still it's not a highlighted here so I will have to wait to highlight it let's see guys so see guys uh, still it's not a highlighted I will have to wait let's see I have to wait might be yeah internet is already connected guys so I will have to wait now phone is a uh, rebooting so let's see when it will uh, start guys it will uh, start to highlight here now it's highlighted when highlighted immediately just you have to execute this and all right let it minimize I will come here now we are ready to execute it let's see let me minimize it it's still rebooting okay let me go here yes it is done let me confirm once again now see guys 
deactivate device successfully so four five times tells it's not going to here yeah, giving deactivate i device successfully so now what i will do guys here simply i will do okay here and i will just come on itunes now see guys here options success your phone has been unlocked so of course i can go for continue it and uh, we will get opportunity to generate new apple id and password of course now we are ready to go for see successfully this has been unlocked with the help of so four five times just you will have to tell it's not going to give us successfully deactivate i device guys so this is all about in this video tutorial guys this is exceptional method with the help of especially uh, itunes and uh, for time being just we have to use here say your tools guys use these features and easily you will be able to terminate iCloud activations if you have a still any problem any confusions yeah if you're facing any technical error of course you have to raise the query below the comment box guys I will reply as soon as possible according to your query and once again let you remind you have to create a same virtual network virtual private network Wi-Fi and in abbreviately form I can say that's your country belongs so suppose this phone belongs from Australia you will have you will have to generate VPN of your Australia so that easily you will be able to otherwise you will have to again and again click on this to deactivate but continue just you will have to uh, use this option four five times and you will get a result so this is all about in this video tutorial guys if this video is acknowledgeable then please don't forget like and subscribe to my channels because this is a thing that will inspire me to make more and more video for education purpose guys so thank you very much have a great time